I just clamped it to the bench. I beat on the ridge until it until it beat this piece off. All it was was just slid over it and then crimped. It was for stability. So and now we've got our flat piece of steel to work with. So it's thin, pretty lightweight. That's another another bonus that I like about this type of knife is they are extremely lightweight and I've had extremely good service as far as chopping and stuff. I did kind of booger up this end a little bit but that's okay because you can see kind of from the diagram I'm going to chop that off anyway. So what I'm going to do now is uh, I'm going to go ahead and bring up my angle grinder with the cutoff blade and I'm just going to trim out my basic shape. Okay, as you can see, uh, I only made one cut right here. Who knows? Maybe a piece of metal for a future blade of some kind. Lightweight. And you can kind of see uh, from here, I'm going to make it a little bit bigger than what I had right here in my drawing. That's a wonderful thing about doing this. You can just build it to suit your needs. And uh, I'm going to swap blades on my angle grinder, put a regular blade back on it. And I'm just going to run up and down the edges till I smooth it out and get the contours that I want. Like I said, this is very easy to cut. It's not real hard. Uh, and I think it should make for a, a great Bushman's knife. So let me get this locked up and uh, I'll get right back to you. And uh, we're going to go ahead and clamp. Take a piece forward, lay it down. Make sure it's secured really good. Excuse the mess of my workbench, but that's what a workbench is for to be used. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, now for the back side to trim out for the handle, get rid of some of these, get rid of some of these, uh, these teeth. Because you don't want to be grabbing a hold of some teeth when you, on your handle.
And there you go. This is a makeshift Bushman's knife out of a saw blade. And on the back side, as you can see, there's still teeth. There's really no edge on this, but we can. I'm going to use a, just a regular chain top file real quick. all the burrs and the edges so you don't get little metal slivers Dead to put on it, and the hand and the handle made. So there you have it. And again soon and I'll catch you on the flip side. Peace. And be safe. I'd just like to remind everybody to cherish your friends and your family because what you have today 
might not be here tomorrow. Y'all take care, be safe, and God bless. Thanks for watching.